Okay, they want to know which statement illustrates the additive identity property. Well, it's actually the first one, um, <laughs> which is nice because here they have 6 plus 0 equals 6. Well, when you see the additive identity, uh, the key word for me is the word additive, right? We're adding. And identity, your identity is not changing. So 0 is the additive element, right? But this is the additive, excuse me, identity because it does not change the number 6. Multiplicative identity would be 1. You add, multiply by 1 and nothing changes. Here, choice 2 is, right, this is the additive inverse property because you're adding two opposites and getting 0. 3 and four, uh, three is an example of the distributive property, multiplying 4 by 6 and 3. 4 is an example of the associative property. Right? It would be commutative if you change the order, like 4 plus 3 plus 6. That would be commutative. It wouldn't change, right? But the, the order changes. The associative property, which is what number 4 is, is the changing of the grouping of the numbers, or the way you group with parentheses. All right, hope this helped.